Yeah, Sunday if need be. I say let's just take care of business today and tomorrow and sweep the Rays in two games. But listen, we know the players are excited, right? I mean, the love they have for each other and what they have shown on the field this year is simply amazing. But it really is about the fans, right? I mean, Cleveland has the best fans in the land. I know it's cliche, but it is true. We know that. And there is a lot going on for them once they get inside Progressive Field. And that's where we bring in Vice President of Communications, Curtis Danberg. Curtis, morning. morning. This is amazing. This is really amazing. is. I mean, a story that nobody really could have predicted. We want to pretend we could have predicted it, but we're talking about the youngest team in baseball. Yeah, we, you mentioned earlier about opening day. Like, none of us could have predicted being here. Winning the division, we thought maybe we'd contend for a wild card beer. We're in the wild card round, but we won our division by 11 games. Who would have thought that? It's been awesome. It really is incredible. The numbers are just, I mean, amazing. So what can fans expect when they get inside the ballpark here over the wild card weekend? Get down here early. Gates will open at 10 o'clock. want to be in your seats by 1130. Get ready for the pregame festivities. A uh, lot in store. We want you to rock your red. Okay. We'll be handing out these rally towels. Stand for the land. Is, the, is our game plan, so looking forward to that. Mm -hmm. And you're going to honor some people as well. Yeah, so John Adams, we wish 50th season of uh, him supporting us. I wish he could be here, so we sent out, took a little camera out there to uh, film something we'll show pregame. Uh, great way to honor him. Obviously, we took his bench and uh, put a replica drum out in Heritage Park, so go check that out. Uh, rub it, give us some good luck for the year. One thing I always get a kick out of is people wondering if this place will be packed, okay? Every, you know, because obviously, you know, during the season, not every game is a full house. But when it comes to the playoffs, this place is always rocking and the atmosphere is going to be great. And there's still a chance to get in, right? I'm excited for these young players. Yeah. Because they have not seen when this place gets going. It's pretty special. Uh, so we'll have a few tickets, 1,000 tickets remain for today, sold out tomorrow, standing room only, $35 tickets tomorrow, and then plenty of tickets for Sunday. But like you said, hopefully we don't need it. Yeah, hopefully we don't need that. No question about it. So that's standing room only. That's not a bad deal. 35, 35 bucks, bucks, right? Yep. So wake up in the morning and get out here to Progressive Field. Yes, we need your support. We do. Uh, everyone kind of has a tradition that, <laughs> that, that they might do. Yours was? I went to Gunselman's last night, so before the season, before opening day, I went and got a Guardian Burger at Gunselman's. I had to do that. We had such a great year, I said, I got to do it again. So, uh, phenomenal burger, best burgers in town, Gunselman's in Fairview Park. I do love Gunselman's, no doubt about it. Curtis, thank you so much. It's ready. Rock your ready red. Rock your red, everybody. That's Stand right. for the land. Rays fired in up. town. Let's take down the Rays. Wow. We are fired up. The only thing I'm not fired up about right now is the fact that there's a little bit of rain get here, Holly. So, let's take no. care. Let's get that out now, right, so we can play some baseball. For sure. Yeah, none of that's my fault, by the way. You know that. We're going to make sure that it, <laughs> oh, it, <laughs> it's, no. it departs ASAP. <laughs> Um, we're rocking the red in studio too. That's awesome. I love to see all the energy and uh, it's only going to get better throughout the day. So